I was young. I was 12, in between 12 and 13. I remember getting, um, I remember getting raped. There was more than one person in the room. By then, I think there was like four. All I remember is saying no, no, and trying to kick them off. I woke up in a closet. I had blood everywhere. I remember my mom asking me where I was. I didn't tell her what happened. I just kind of kept it to myself. I was insecure about my teeth, and um, the older I got, the more I was stopped smiling. I don't remember ever going to a dentist or anything like that. Took about five minutes or so for the cement to harden, and then we'll put another elastic on it. By the time I was maybe about 15, 16, right before my, um, had my, got pregnant with my son, I was already living on my own. So that's it for today. Okay. We'll put that bracket on that one the next time. We'll check that. Okay. Okay? Okay. Thank you. So 9.30, uh, December 21st. 21st. Yes. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, bye. Okay, see ya. Bye. Bye. I put this blade here. There's two different kind of blades. I usually use that one and maybe like a rounded one. And what I have to do is I have to slice the skin open. Mm -hmm. And then I dip the, um, the blade into the pigment mm -hmm. and then I cut again. Um, mm -hmm. You're about my 20th customer. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so how did you get into doing eyebrows? Well, I wanted to do my own, but I couldn't afford it. <laughs> mm -hmm. And I um, knew other women who wanted to do it, but couldn't afford it. Mm -hmm. Especially, uh, you know, meth, uh, former meth addicts. And, you know, with my friends also. Mm -hmm. That, you know, having eyebrows is like something that we all makes us feel beautiful, mm -hmm. you know? <laughs> mm -hmm. So I said, huh, oh, how bad can it be, you know? Mm -hmm. So I watched tons and tons and tons of video and went through the school online and I got my license and then I did my own. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then I was like, okay. Then I started, yeah, I started doing other people's eyebrows. Nice, yours look good, I like yours. Thanks. Grandkids are great. Yeah, have, they are. Yeah, I have five, so. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I can't believe it. You don't look old enough to have five grandkids. Well, I'm 43. My oldest gave me all five. Oh, wow. My oldest is 26. Wow. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna let you look at it. Okay. And you can. Should I sit up? Yeah, if you want to. <laughs> That's good. By the time I was 13, I was already smoking meth. It was kind of like a thing to just numb everything. I ended up getting traffic by the pimp. So I've been doing about six months, and we're going to see how that, you got that one tooth in the cross by on the top there. We'll try to see yeah. how that's coming along now. And then this one here, uh -huh. on, on one of my traffickers hit me in my face and busted one of my teeth. And so there was a chip on my tooth in the front. Because of that, when I would smoke meth, it started decaying, like, quickly. You know when you know somebody has been in the same situation and there's, like, no judgment? Because, yeah. like, 
some of the people I work with are like, why were you in prison? Like, or like they Google me to like be stupid and they see like whatever. I'm like, yeah, that was me. All right, so it's right. comforting when I was like able to be like, yeah, I know this person and I remember this shit. And oh my fucking God, I can't believe I was here. <laughs> and, you know what I mean? Like, I gravitate to more of the survivors that want to talk about it. No. Yeah. Yeah. That it's okay, that it's like, I'm so glad that you, I can say something to you and you know what I'm talking about. Yeah. Right. You know, if yeah. I'm saying, oh, she used to be the bottom. Right. Like, yeah. we right. know what you're, yeah, you're, yeah, you're that's you know, yeah. right. By the time I was in high school, I was gone already, <laughs> you know? Yeah. No, yeah. Because that's the average age is like 12 to 13. Because I got this when I was 13. Even this, I have one, like, homemade one. No, on yeah, the, yeah, my but, two, yeah. yeah, my two homemade, yeah. Back then, I didn't know it was trafficking. I was just thinking, oh, I just been with all these crazy people. They manipulate your mind so much. So after a certain point, you kind of think that that's what you were made for. Because you think, I'm stupid. How am I going to make money? I can't go back to college. I have a son. I'm, I don't know what to do. There's this part of a poem that I used to recite. I'm here to serve the perversions of this world, to make Satan smile but to make the Lord weep. And all the perversions and the scum of the earth, they glorify all that I am. And the only person that I loathe is myself. This binder oh. exploded today. Oh, OK. So I, he can, can he take it home and put it back together? Yeah, okay. yeah, of course. OK, and then so he said his head was sore, like right here. So he went to the health room. Yeah. So he's over there now. He's supposed to be making his way this way to come get his stuff. OK. But um, maybe you can intercept him. Yeah, yeah, no yeah. Okay. thank you so much. Hi, love. You feel better? No. Why, what happened? I have a headache. Sorry. You don't feel good? My pug is full of stuff and fell out. Mm. It's okay. Your brother took it home. We'll go fix it when we get home, okay? You come with mommy? Yeah, but how did Ralph get it? I gave it to him. The teacher told me, and then I said, oh, okay. And we, we uh, put it inside your backpack, and we can deal with it after when we get home, okay? Okay. Are you hungry? Did you eat anything? No. Why, you didn't like your lunch? Well, it has taken me a long time to, to get used to, like, thinking ahead. You know, especially um, for the kids. Yeah, for daddy, for daddy. Okay, You have to remember these dates. You have to remember what time it is. You have to remember what to bring in that appointment. was so bad, you know, and I always feel like the worst, you know. The worst parent. Especially when they would say, what's wrong with you? you know, who forgets that stuff? Where's your belt? Did it fall out? Oh, no, yes. No. no, it was on the side. See, that's what happens when you're playing around, baby. OK. OK, I'm going to check it. Okay. Stay with him. Yeah. OK. I remember thinking that I'd, I wanted to get out of the life, but I just didn't know how to. And I remember thinking, you know, Lord, I don't even know if you're real. All I know is that I need to get out of here. I said, you gotta help me. You gotta 
You gotta help me if you're real, you know, like, I don't know how to get out of this life. After the years of finally not saying nothing, slowly I started talking about what happened. When my oldest son finally heard, he cried. And a lot of it was like, wait, now I understand why mom was like, and some of it just kind of plays out. And then you realize, I need to let, now I can let go of this anger because now I understand why it was there. My son was finally able to let go of some of his um, past in order so that he could move forward. Okay, no game. Uh -huh. Yeah. <laughs> it looks it looks pretty good. The, the retainers will hold everything in position. How do you feel? Good. That's good. Lighter. Okay. <laughs> oh, I just got done. I just got done. Yeah. <laughs> do you see the picture? Yeah. <laughs> Happy for you. Thank you. I love you. Okay. Okay, love you. Bye. There is people generally that want to help you. If somebody's asking for help, usually it's there's a reason, you know. If you can't help them, at least try to find somebody else that can. I used to live between heaven and hell. The perverted, lustful, greedy, and selfish invited me in. And the only person I loathed at the time was myself. One death led to my freedom. Education is key. Mentoring and mentors are key. All these tools was placed in my path towards recovery. It took a while to truly be free even after I was no longer held in captivity. But I look in the mirror today and I smile because I have three things that replace my misery. Faith, hope, and aloha. And the greatest of these is aloha. <laughs>